How I do Salesforce, part two. As a consultant, I often find that I have to log in as other users in Salesforce for testing, internal QA, whatever it might be, sometimes even debugging or investigating a potential issue that they might be having. And it's very time consuming to have to go to the gear set icon, access setup, search for users, and then search for the user that I want to log in as, and then click log in as that user. That takes forever. And so I want to show you how I log in as other users in Salesforce using the Salesforce Inspector Reloaded extension, which is super helpful and makes things so, so much faster. So without any delays, let's jump right in. Here we are in Salesforce. And what I want to do is log in as another user. Now, usually the way that people do this is they go to setup. Then once they're in the back end, they search for users here. They click on users to access the user setup page. Then they scroll down and find the user they're looking for. Now, luckily in my case, I don't have a lot of users in this dev environment, but as you might be aware, some orgs have hundreds of users. And so this could be a little bit daunting, but then essentially you'd find the user you're looking for, and then you click login as, and this will open up a new tab where you're logged in as that specific user. Now, what happens, however, though, is if you go back to the tab you already had open and you hit refresh or you click on something else, you notice that here, for example, I am now also logged in as that other user. So multi tabs with this feature isn't very good. You're going to get logged out for every tab that you have open and everything is going to be logged into that user that you selected. So the way that I like to do this is if I now just close all these tabs and I log out so I can go back to my user. Um, so I'll just log back in. So now I'm back to the admin user, I'm back to my user. And in fact, what I'll do is I'll even go back to the sales app where we had opened before. So the way that I like to do this is using the Salesforce Inspector Reloaded extension. If you notice here on the right hand side of my screen, there is a little blue arrow pointing left or pointing outwards. I click there and then it opens up the Salesforce Inspector Reloaded extension for me. And so here, what I want to do is under these tabs on the top, I want to click on users and then it brings up my user because that's the one that I'm logged in as. But now all I want to do is search for the user that I want to log in as. So in this case, he's called Carlos. So here it is, Carlos. This is the user I want to log in as. So if I click on that, I can now see details about this user. And then all I have to do is click try login as. And as long as you have the login as feature enabled in your org, then this will work for you. Now, note that this won't fix the issue of having multiple tabs open. They will still all be logged out. But generally, when I log in as another user, I make sure that I only have one tab open. That way, I'm not losing any work or anything that I might be in the middle of. If you need to have multiple tabs open with different users, there is another extension um, that provides this functionality. I've never used it myself, but a friend of mine showed it to me once. And so if you'd like to see that, make sure you drop a comment down below and I'm happy to make a quick video on that as well. Other than that, I hope this was helpful. And next time you have to log in as another user, hopefully you won't have to navigate all the way to the back end find the user to try and log in as you can just use this handy little extension for Chrome and do it the way that I do it.